much for joining me today. Today I will be reviewing for you guys this pair of glasses and the place where I purchased them. So if you're interested in getting some super affordable glasses, just keep on watching. are so dang expensive. Many times when you visit the eye doctor, um, you know, you'll see a price on the frames themselves, but there's gonna be an additional cost for the lenses. So, basically, they had reached out to me and I kinda hesitated a little bit, to be honest, because I felt like it almost was too good to be true. So, um, I did go to the website, I didn't immediately order, but I did sign up to receive emails. So it took me like almost a year from the point where they contacted me to actually order the glasses. So basically I let all the time pass by and I was like, you know what? Um, I think it was like nearing my uh, next uh, eye appointment. So I was like, I'm gonna go to the eye doctor, I'm gonna get my prescription and I'm not going to get a pair of glasses at the eye doctor. I'm just gonna order them through here. And if it ends up working out, then it ends up working out. If it doesn't, then I'll just go get me a pair of the eye doctor. Um, I felt like for the price ranges that they had online, like $20, $30, it was nothing compared to the five, $600. So um, I did just that. I got my prescription because you do need your prescription. You can either upload it to the website once you create an account or you can just type it in. So I got my prescription. I chose the frames that I wanted. Um, and I did have a coupon code that I used because like I said, I had signed up for their emails. So they have sales quite often. I believe the coupon code that I used, it was like get a pair free basically. And I, the only cost or the only amount that I ended up paying was the shipping and handling, which ended up being like $10.90. $10.90. Compared to $500. That's just, it still blows my mind. Um, they have some white on the side, and then the inside part of it, um, they are white. And then the outside, this is black. So I am extremely, extremely satisfied with these glasses, especially for the price. They're not um, like any particular brand name, they're like generic. They have like well, it says, I don't know if that's a D or O Pont Snake. I don't know. I don't care. All I care is that I can see. And that's another thing. With them being so cheap, I was like, is the lens, like, are they actually going to make them um, for my prescription? And just to be on the safe side, <clears throat> I did visit my eye doctor and I got the prescription read on the lens. So basically they'll just take it to the back and they'll read um, the actual lens and just make sure that it fits your prescription. So I did that and everything turned out fine luckily and I was extremely, extremely relieved because that was like my biggest worry. With it being your eyes, I feel like you never want to like go cheap just because it's cheap, you know? Like you can end up damaging your eyesight even more. So yeah guys, this website is legit. <laughs> And now I'm just going to walk you through kind of the process of ordering online and kind of what the website looks like in case you're a little bit skeptical like I was. So this is what you see when you go to Fermo.com. As you can see in the very top, it's broken down by eyeglasses, sunglasses, daily new, didn't mean to click on that, uh, any sales, and then the featured styles. Um, and then down here, just kind of recommendations. Uh, there's sunglasses and then these other glasses. These are customer reviews pretty much. This is measuring your PD, which is your pupillary distance, which is how far apart your eyes are. 
Um, that helps once you select your glasses just to make sure that that style will look right on you basically. Um, then your face shape and then a little tutorial on how to order. So for example, let's say let's go to eyeglasses and then women's glasses. And I would go down, these are all the different styles and you can see the awesome prices, $19, $29. Let's say I wanted these. These are so unique. Look how cute those are. These come in different patterns. <clears throat> Ooh, I like that. Tortoise. So like uh, 90s. <laughs> um, and this tells me that they are narrow. Um, so uh, there's some that are wide. Um, so this is the best for pH, best for PD, 5980, and I believe it's in millimeters, yeah. Um, so you just have to kind of measure pupil to pupil uh, and see how far apart they are. And um, you either can do it yourself. I know my prescription already had that information. So tells you they're plastic, oh, that's cute, um, any reviews, and these are kind of other kind of similar styles down at the bottom, bigger frames. So once you choose your style, um, of course you're going to do this while you're signed in, you create an account if you don't have one, you're going to, you're going to choose your style and then you're going to make sure your prescription is uploaded or if you uh, just want to type that in you can type it in so once that's in there then you will choose your lens um, you'll choose what type of lens you want you can either choose go with like the very basic or if you want a more premium lens and you would just pay the additional cost for that so yeah guys as you saw they have a ton of different styles if you want to stick with just fashion uh, glasses or if you want to try out their sunglasses and they also have the prescription sunglasses which is probably what is going to be my next purchase because I've been wanting prescription sunglasses for the longest time but I just can't get myself to pay like two three hundred dollars for something that I'm only literally going to be used while I'm driving so I'm super excited about that I hope you guys are excited along with me if you do um, end up uh, making a purchase let me know down in the comments down below if I left out anything that you guys wanted to know again feel free to comment that down below as well thank you so much for watching guys I hope you enjoyed this video if you did enjoy give it a thumbs up please and share it with anyone that you think will benefit and if you're not subscribed already don't forget to hit that subscribe button and I will see you guys next time attach it here somehow but it was like ridiculous, Karen, because for a more natural look rather than the fake Escobar look. So yeah, you just gotta, you know, hide some of the white with some of the eyelash or the makeup.